remember this guy? <laughs> Hello, brother. How you doing? Gary learned through my father-in-law that he had a son-in-law that it was overseas in Iraq. Good. It's only been a few years. 20 years ago? <laughs> that was a rifle platoon leader um, with the 3rd Infantry Division, so we were among the first into Baghdad. Where's Megan? Megan. She's right here. Hey, come here. <laughs> Basically a Lieutenant Dan from Forrest Gump. I held the same job again. So Megan gave me a letter to give to Justin, and I took it with me to Iraq and gave it to him. letters took nine weeks, so it was immediate. It was amazing. He just pulls it out of his pocket and just hands it to me. I didn't know what it was at first. I had no idea. And I just remember looking at him and looking down, and it was probably the best gift I've ever received. Mr. Sinise? Hey. How are you? That's the one we're in. It's uh, 6.57. Just told us to sit down and we're going to fire up the engines and get going. Heading off to Wade City. Thanks a lot for coming. Oh, it's great to be here. We are at Camp Yudari. We're probably about 15 miles or something like that. I think 15 miles from the border of Iraq. And we've got guys that have been up in Iraq and all over the place that are here. Have for you is the people at home miss you. There's about a thousand guys in here, but there's a timetable, so they, they told me to kind of move a little bit faster and not take so much time talking to everybody. I want to talk to everybody. Thank you for coming today. Thank you for coming. Okay, listen up, listen up. What we're going to do, this is not working fast enough. A lot of guys. <laughs> We're going to form vertical lines on each of those folks in the middle. Listen up, listen up. If you don't like the plan, you go change place with those folks out there. It's pretty incredible. Oh, crazy. Hi, how are you? It is tremendous to be here with you tonight. This is my first USO tour. But it's the first of many. Because I'm going to come back many, many times over the over my lifetime, I guarantee it. That's our plane. Where are we going? We're going to Baghdad. Well, I, I wish I had the video camera because I, I was up there near the landing. And we flew in low at 500 feet for, you know, 20 minutes. Where are we right now? How about in this area? We just passed Basra. We're heading up into, uh, up towards Baghdad. Well, I got to see a lot. Huh? 4,000 people. Guess we're making a speech or what are we doing? Hey guys, this is the actor's actor and your friend who supports the military more than anybody out there. Come on, Mr. Gary Sinise! That 
first trip to Iraq in June of 2003 was pretty special, and we thought we'd take a look back 20 years later and give you a little look at some footage that has really never been seen before. The tour was called Project Salute, and it featured 180 entertainers, athletes, the Dallas Cowboy cheerleaders. There were country singers, rap artists, comedians. Robert De Niro even showed up. And that day in the hangar with thousands of troops present, I was able to locate Justin Morseth and hand him the letter that Megan had given to me. It was incredible. And then John Stamos jumped on the drums and Kid Rock knocked everybody out. That was the first of many, many, many USO tours and, and tours overseas and across the country and to military bases and hospitals. And all of that manifested into the creation of the Gary Sinise Foundation to serve and honor the needs of our veterans, our first responders, those who serve our country. And it's been a great joy to look back now 20 years at this journey and know that there's so much more to come.